<laughs> All right, so you want to get into a rest mount, and from this side, it doesn't really matter, but it just helps with accuracy. You're going to um, open the bucket, thumb and uh, index, and you want to land on this string so that both strings are resting on it. Now, if you only land on one string, like that, if it looks like this, then you've, you, um, you're you not in the right formation. Uh, it starts off in the wrist mount. This is what it looks like. It's pretty simple, but um, if you don't do it right, if you don't understand the mechanics behind it, it's very easy to get knots. So you start in the wrist mount, you open the bucket up. And it helps to put your uh, throw hand forward because you want to land on this string so that they're all on the string like that. And you let, let go of your uh, not throw hand thumb and just position it so that you're in a heart mount. And then you're going to flip it forward like that and let go. And then, and then you have your broken heart. Now, um, if you only land on one string, like that, if it looks like this, um, you're going to get a knot because it's not, you, ha you didn't land properly on both strings. You flip it backward, you won't get a knot. But if you ever have that problem, it's because you only land landed on one string. So you want to make sure you land on both strings like that. And if you're in this position, you're golden, you're, you know, you can proceed. And you want to drop it just like that. The last tip is, um, if you do like that, it's just like going to um, look clean, you know, and that the heart, the broken heart element will not be so good.